the show. It's time, let's go. Grab your friends and get ready. Here comes our friend Yeti. Let's open up our Bibles. Become true disciples. Y'all ready to grow? It's the Yeti Show. Let's go. And then he said, but the applesauce is frozen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thanks, Leo. Everyone, I present my new pizza invention. Cheesy cheese pizza with extra cheese and cheese stuffed crust with a cheese reduction sauce and a hint of a dash of extra cheesy cheese spread throughout. <laughs> wow, this looks and smells great. Yeah, great job, Randy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, let's eat. Oh, wait. Let's pray first. Oh yeah. Praying before a meal is a great way to say thanks to God for providing food for us. It's also a great time to ask him to bless the food so it'll be nourishing to our bodies. Good point, nourishing. It's good for our bodies and it helps us grow. Okay, sorry, well, I was just so hungry and this pizza looks so good. Okay, well, let's pray. Um, uh, Randy, since this is a celebration of your new pizza, would you like to lead the prayer? Um, uh, per P pray? Yeah. Well, I, um, <coughs> uh, um, uh, duh. <laughs> um, uh, we'll bow our heads and close our eyes. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Good idea, bro. <laughs> okay, so just, um, <coughs> uh, here we go. Uh, Randy? Y you okay, bro? Randy? R Randy? What? Where did he go? Randy? Randy? What just happened? There's a mystery afoot! No, I think I know what happened. But still, there's only one person who can solve the mystery of the missing Randy! And who would that be? Inspector Nitty! I'll be right back. Where is he going? I don't know, but I think I know what happened to Randy. As do I, Mr. Sitting to Randy's left! Or should I say, I will know once I solve the mystery of the missing Randy. For I am Inspector Nettie! LLC. Nettie, I think I know what happened. Hey, I didn't go through a 10 minute online course for detective work to not be called Inspector. Okay, Inspector Nettie, I think I know what happened to Randy. Uh, you know what? Let's just stick with Nettie. Inspector's a little too formal. Nettie, we don't need a detective. I know what happened. Maybe, but let's let this play out. Miss Haley Beth, where were you two minutes ago at the time of Randy's vanishing? I was right here. I can cooperate that. Okay, you're in the clear for now. Mr. Blake, if that is your real name. You know it is. I can also cooperate that. Where were you? Two minutes ago. I was sitting right here next to Randy, and then I asked him to pray, and I think he got a little nervous and ran off. Whoa, 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 whoa. Slow down, you're going too fast. You said you were seated by Randy? How, how do you spell that? Is it two E's or just one? Maybe an E-Y or an I-E, or possibly two Y's, two I Nettie, we don't have time for this. We need to show Randy that he doesn't need to be scared to pray. In fact, that's our main point today. God gives me courage to pray. That's so good. Let's say it all together. God gives me courage. God, God gives, gives me courage, courage to pray. To pray. pray. Okay, we need to split up and search for Randy. I'll check my record shop. And I'll check in Drip Dry Gulch and the treehouse. And I'll stay here and inspect around the pizza. Maybe there are some clues inside of the pizza. All right, let's do this. But first, let's pray. Good call. Dear Lord, we praise you and thank you for all you've done. Help us, Lord, to find Randy so that we can let him know that you give us the courage to pray. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. All right, let's go, guys. Okay, pizza, if that is your real name. What delicious secrets are you hiding? Let me see. They look cheesy. I'm going to need a plate here. Oh, yeah, I'm so sad. I got really scared and I got out of there. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Miss Haley Beth, what are you doing here? Uh, it is my record shop, Randy. Oh, right, 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 right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Plus, I was looking for you. 
We all got worried when you left the pizza shop. Oh, you, uh, you noticed that, huh? Yeah. Were you nervous to pray? Well, yeah. Uh, I pray a lot, but, but praying in front of others can be scary, and I wasn't sure if I was going to do it right or say the wrong thing, you know? Yeah, well, first off, you never need to be scared to pray. Oh, really? Yeah. In fact, that's our main point today. God gives me the courage to pray. Oh, well, that's cool. Yeah, the Bible says in 2 Timothy 1 verse 7, For God has not given us a spirit of fear, but of power and of love and a sound mind. We don't have to be afraid when we pray. Jesus even said in the book of Matthew, That where two or more are gathered in my name, there I am with them. When we talk to God, he's there listening. Wow, but, but what if my prayer over the food was, was wrong? Prayer is simple. It's just you talking to God. So when you pray for food, just thank Him for the food He's provided and thank Him that it will be nourishing to your body. Wow, well, well that's pretty easy. Even when you pray in front of others, it's still just you talking to God. You know, there's a song that's all about prayer. I think it would really help you. It's called Pray Every Day by Buddy Prescott. Oh, I love Buddy Prescott. He inspired me to start my own band, Mandy, Randy, and the Andes. <laughs> Sweet, let's go over to the treehouse. And while we do that, let's listen to the song. Sounds good, let's do it! Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us of our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. I talk to God through prayer. God gives me courage to pray. Was my prayers, I pray every day. I get a resource with thanksgiving and praise. I look to the Lord and His strength and always seek His face. It's okay, it's alright. Pray every day, and every night. Praying something now. I'm praying softer 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 now. I'm praying louder 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 now. It's okay. It's alright. Pray every day. Every day, every day, I will pray. I talk to God through prayer. God gives me courage to pray. Jesus empowers my prayers. I pray every day. I get a resource with thanksgiving and praise. I look to the Lord and His strength. Randy isn't here or at Drip Dry Gulch. Let me know if he comes back to the pizza shop. Oh wait, he's here with Miss Haley Beth. I'll call you back, Nettie. Randy, I'm so glad that we found you. He was listening to some tunes at the record shop. Yeah, it's where I like to go to think. The tunes and vibes clear my mind. <laughs> oh, and I also had a really good talk with Miss Haley Beth. I learned God gives me the courage to pray. You know, he really does. In fact, Jesus showed us how to pray. It's called the Lord's Prayer. It's found in the Bible in Matthew chapter six. And it goes like this. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us of our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Whoa, there was a lot of big words and thighs and arts in there. You know, that's true, but that's the King James translation, which can sound a little bit strange sometimes, but 
Jesus gives us a great formula on how to pray. Really? Yep, we start by thanking God for all he has done for us. We enter his presence with thanksgiving and praise. We thank him for Jesus and the amazing sacrifice that he made for us. And then we present our prayer requests. We pray for those around us and then we pray for the things we need. If we need something or we need help with the way we're acting or feeling, he's listening and he wants to help. Yeah, he sure does. And we just end it with praise again because God is amazing. Oh, that's awesome. Thanks, praise, then our needs, and then thanks and praise again. Huh, nice. And just like our memory verse says, we can be confident when we talk to God. Well, what memory verse? Why don't we check it out real quick? Yeah. Hey everyone, it's me, Miss Maddie, and it's time for our memory verse. Remember, we do our memory verse so that you can keep it in your heart all the time. Our verse today comes from the book of 1 John, and it shows us just how much God loves when we pray. We can go to Him with all of our needs because He hears our prayers. So, when you're ready, say, let's go. Let's go! Great, we're gonna say the verse three times. First, I'll say it, then you're gonna repeat after me, and then we'll say it all together. All right, let's do it. This is the confidence we have in approaching God that if we ask anything according to His will, He hears us. 1 John 5.14 Great job, everyone. Now repeat after me. This is the confidence we have in approaching God, that if we ask anything according to His will, He hears us. 1 John 5.14 Wow, that was amazing. Now let's say it all together. This is the confidence we have in approaching God, that if we ask anything according to His will, He hears us. 1 John 5.14. Great job, everyone. That was amazing, and I love that verse. Now remember, keep saying it and keep it in your heart. Oh, that's so cool. But how do we pray according to his will? Like, uh, how do we know his will? Well, uh, Randy, it's all in the Bible. That's why it's so important to read and study the Bible so that we can know what he wants in our lives. <laughs> Just like Jeremiah 29, 11, for I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. Plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and a future. Whoa, and we can pray that over our lives? Every single day. God gives me the courage to pray. I think I'm ready to pray over our pizza now. Yes, I cannot wait to eat it. Well, while we head back to the pizza shop, let's check out the joke of the day. Yeah, come on guys, let's go. And now it's time for the joke of the day. What? Howdy y'all, it's me, Cody the Core Values Cowboy, and I'm as excited as a rope to lasso to tell you the joke of the day. Here we go. What? is a horse's favorite drink. Lemon? Nay! <laughs> like a, like a, like a horse says nay! Oh, that's good. Shoo! That was a funny one. And that was the joke of the day. Pizza? Oh, sweet pizza! I got pizza on my mind. And in my belly! Whoa, whoa. Betty, uh, we're back and we found Randy. Well, I knew I could solve the case of the missing Randy, but uh, how'd I do it? Randy was at the record shop. Yeah, Miss Haley Beth and Mr. Blake really helped me. They taught me that God gives us courage to pray. Well, I'm glad Inspector Nettie could be of assistance. Uh, wait, where's all the pizza? Oh, um, uh, it's time for Inspector Nettie to leave. What? Oh, oh, hey everyone! Nettie, where's the pizza? Oh, oh, that inspector guy must have eaten it. Inspector Eddie was his name, I think. Nettie? Okay, it was me. I've been Inspector Nettie all along. The truth has finally been revealed. But don't worry, I ordered another pizza. <laughs> 
Thanks, Leo. This looks so good. Let's eat! Uh, but first, let's pray. Randy, you wanna pray for us? I'd be honored. Lord Jesus, thank you for this awesome pizza. Thank you, Lord, that is nourishing to our bodies and gives us energy. We thank you, Lord, for all you do. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Great job, Randy. Way to go. Yeah, that was awesome. And thanks to all of you for helping me to learn that God gives me courage to pray. Let's eat. <laughs> oh, sorry. sorry, sorry. And Leo, we need a pizza cutter. Oh, what's up, everybody? I'm Tang, and it's time for the core values. I love the core values. They are my absolute favorite. Thought it'd be rad to go over each one of them at some of my favorite locations. Ha, ah, let's jump right into it. Whoa, I'm in outer space. Cool. Ha <laughs> ha. Our first core value is love God because God loved us first. Let's all say love God in slow motion like we're floating in space. Ready? Love God. Ha <laughs> ha. Great job everyone. On to the next one. Oh, 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 this is crazy. Just like our second core value, love people. Oh, we love people because God loves all people. Ah, so throw your hands in the air with me and swing them around while saying our second core value. Love people. Ah, love people. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa. Ha <laughs> ha, our third core value is do your best. And we do our best because God will do the rest. Ha <laughs> ha, that's so awesome, just like the ocean. So come on, say do your best, just like you're underwater. Do your best. Ha <laughs> ha, to the next one. Ha <laughs> ha, cool, I'm a knight. I've always wanted to be one. Ha <laughs> ha, hey. That's so much fun, just like our final core value. Have fun. We have fun because God gives us joy. Ha <laughs> ha, let's all say have fun as loud as you can. You ready? One, two, three. Have fun! Ha <laughs> ha. That was so great. Thanks for checking out our core values with me, Tank. Da -da 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 -da. Core values. Ow! Ha <laughs> ha. Nice. How do I get home? God gives me the courage to pray. And that's so awesome. Talking to God is so important. God, the creator of the universe, wants a relationship with you. And how do you grow a relationship? And just like you do with your friends, by talking to them communicating with them. That's how we grow our relationship with God, by talking to him through prayer. But maybe you've never asked God to be your best friend. Well, it's really easy. We actually do it through prayer. So if you want Jesus to be your very best friend, then bow your head, close your eyes, and repeat these words after me. Dear Jesus, thank you for giving your life on the cross for me. Come into my heart. Forgive me of my mistakes. Make me brand new. Be my very best friend. And help me to pray. Lord, I love you. And I thank you. And it's in your name we pray. And all God's people said, Amen. Wow, if that was your very first time asking God into your heart, then I want you to know that I am so proud of you. And I want you to tell somebody in your life that you love and trust because they're gonna be so proud of you too. Mr. Blake, Mr. Blake, Mr. Blake. Hey, Nettie, how's it going? Oh man, that pizza was the best pizza I've ever had since the first time I had that exact same pizza. <laughs> Yeah, the cheese was amazing. I had no idea that you could stuff that much cheese into one pizza. Oh, that Randy, he really knows how to make a pizza and pray. He sure does, Nettie, and... Whoa, 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 um, 
What just happened? I don't know. I think the power just went out. It looks like the power is out all across town. Whoa! We'll have to figure out what's going on next time. But until then, always remember, God, God gives, gives me courage to pray. pray. All right, let's find the light switch. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! I'm okay.